What's up, guys? We're back again with another Miami Dolphins offense. Today, we're going to go over the tight offset tight end. The play you're going to come out in is Miami out. First thing, if we have one-on-one -on -one coverage, that post route is one of the best routes to throw at one-on-one -on -one coverage and aggressive catch it. You're going to want to audible to corners and slant square and streak circle. And this offense beats cover two, three, and four. Also, what you can do is motion the far left receiver and put him on a drag route in case it's man. You can also still hit the corner because you still have the deep fade, flat, and corner route as well. Here it is against cover four. You notice that the corner is going to sort of take the X route, so we throw it to square on the slant. The one play touchdown against cover four is you're going to want to curl square and streak X and then the curl is going to suck down cover four on the left side and you're going to be able to throw it up over the top of the defense. So if your opponent wants to keep playing cover four all game you can just hit him with this and it'll get him out of it. Against man to man you're going to want to motion him over and notice how the route swap happens against corners or any other play in this formation. So we're going to throw it to the flat route and that guy's never going to get there because he's so far over. If you do motion and the cornerback goes with them and they are in man, notice how the linebacker gets matched up against the receiver. And the receiver is going to win that battle every time because of his higher route running against a lower man coverage linebacker. If they do try to use that, you can always hit the drag underneath as well. If he's a really good user and you want to start mixing them up from covering the flats to the corner, you can motion your running back and drag him. So it's either he's going to go to the flat or he's going to drag. And if he jumps the drag route, you can throw it to the corner on the opposite side. But if you flat him, then you can throw it to the corner on the same side. So you have a beater on either side. and He doesn't know which way the corner is going to actually come from. So this is a great way to mix up his users. And like I said, you could do it to either side. So you can motion the running back to the left and drag him to the right and still have a cover three, four, and two beater. So if you're playing against a guy with a good user, make sure you throw this into the mix. And once again, the audible down is inside zone. You can run it stock, try to get blocking off the edge, make a move and get upfield. The inside zone is the best run in the game. You could also motion the receiver over as you've done before, make it look, everything look the same, and then the cornerback goes over, so you get an extra guy out of the pitcher, and then you're one-on-one -on -one with the safety, make a move and score six. Those are the main plays you want to use, but here are some straggler plays. This play is called Miami Sale. What you want to do is motion the sail route to the left, slant square, and drag triangle. And you could also put running back on a wheel if you like, but you don't have to. And you're just flooding the right side or the left side of the field and making a read appropriately. So this is just a straight flood concept. So you can throw it in to mix it in your opponent as well. But your main plays are going to be Miami out and the corners. Also on Miami out, they have the glitch speed out, so make sure you hit that as well. That concludes the Miami Dolphins tight offset tight end. It's a lot like the Cleveland Browns gun split close. Make sure you check those videos out as well. I have more Miami Dolphins offense of formations coming soon. If you like the video, make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe to the channel.